So now we continue this authentication system in Django. In the previous video, we saw that how to do a registration and a login form. This form by Django form. Now in this video, create a login form by Bootstrap or your custom CSS property. So here I use Bootstrap for the login authentication. So go to just Bootstrap. At first, open your all codes. Here is the login HTML function. If you watch the previous video, then you will better understand. Okay, please watch the previous video. Okay, so here is the login HTML and the form is Django form. And here is the views.py. Here is the user login function. Okay, so here we used a simple login form. Okay, so now go to the bootstrap at first. Okay. So now go to the components and go to forms. Here find a form for login and something. Okay. So just find the form. So now copy this form. Okay. So just copy it and go to templates and go to login HTML. So here just remove this form. This is the Django form and paste this. Okay. So here is the double form tag. So just remove and remove it and the uh, small id for email help. So just remove it and I just want to input tag here type email. So just remove it here change the email address to username because here I use the username. Okay. So here in the input tag there is a name attribute and this is a very important because I use this name attribute in login function. So just give a name attribute username. Okay. So same for password. So just give a name attribute password. The name attribute of the password is password. So just type it. Okay. So you can type anything. Okay. So now go to views.py. Here is the user login function where here okay now here is the django form this is the login form okay so just remove it we don't need it anymore so just remove else block also and remove this also the form is valid okay and just do the right indentation for the return okay now remove it also cd equal to form dot clean data. Now type username variable equal request dot post dot get. This post means method and this get means I want to grab the username by post method and then just type the name attribute of the username. The name attribute of the username is username and the name attribute for password is password. So just create a variable for password equal request dot post dot get. Okay. Now type the name attribute password. Okay. Now change here username equal username and password equal this password. Okay. Now here remove this Django variable form. Okay. So now go to the login HTML and here is the to submit button. So just remove it and here is a checkbox. So just remove it. I want this to this is the input for username and this is the input for password. Okay. Okay. So now go to the views.py. Okay. Now type a if block here for the post method. So the if request dot method equal post. Remember post is in capital. Now if request method is post then this block will run otherwise else nothing. So just here create a else block and just pass statement here okay you can use it or not 
it's your choice okay but you have to use this okay so now run the server and go to the browser and now type the local host okay here is the registration here is the login so i already have registration in the previous video so just click on login here is the username and the password you can change the style okay it's up to you so just username is kaksur and the password i already have registration in the previous video okay so just login welcome the username is my username sorry kaksur is my username you can log out here log out successfully okay so here in this video i have show you how to use the bootstrap form so here is the username so just again type the username and the password okay okay so this is the username so thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe channel okay